Hey everyone, welcome to the uh, demo for the sound exporter. Now, um, the Medieval Battle Sounds is a great package that has some amazing uh, audio combination from Medieval Sounds. This Axon Flesh, for instance, every time you play it, will have a slightly different sound because there's actually three layers and each layer has five different uh, clips. You can see that right here. Uh, Axon Flesh 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then Axe on flesh, the flesh part, and then the impact part. And so every time you click this, it's actually three clips that are being chosen randomly uh, to create a, a much more uh, randomized sound. I mean, there's 125 different combinations here. And that's great for uh, desktop games. You can have easily all these sounds or as many as you want and, and for the most part be okay. Uh, but if you are running up on RAM limitations or you're going for mobile, you might not want to have 15 different clicks or different clips just for a single sound like this or that or that and every single one is slightly different. So there's a new way to export these sounds and I'm going to show that to you right now. Um, you don't need to do it during runtime. I'm just going to create a new empty object here. I'm going to call this uh, audio exporter or maybe audio clip exporter. I'm going to add a component, just search for SFB underscore, and we're going to use the audio clip array combiner, and we're going to do three different uh, layers here. And each one of these layers will be one of these things. So we're going to do the axon on flesh here, and I'll just populate these clips here for each one. All right, now that I've populated these, I am going to make sure that I have uh, the volume set to one, and I'm going to keep the delay set to zero. In fact, let me fix a bit of the script real. All right, there we go. So the volume set to one, that's important. It's default to zero, so make sure you set it to one, otherwise your clips will have no sound. And then we're just gonna click the export clips button. All right, that took about 30 seconds or so. And now if we go to the export audio files, we'll all see all these combined audio, one through 124, zero through 124. So there's 100 different combined audio clips. And now, or 125 different clips, and each one's slightly different. It's the same as if you played the uh, demo scene over there. And if you check it out, it's just a normal WAV file, 123 kilobits. Um, and it's ready for in-game use. So now, instead of having 125 randomly generated uh, options, you can take maybe, you know, five, six, seven different sounds that you like, just go through them and choose which ones you like, and uh, use those for your mobile game. So, it's a great tool, and if you want to, uh, it will overwrite the name here. So just a, a heads up that if you don't change uh, the output name, which right now not set to anything, which is why it's just combined audio, um, we can do a demo test. Uh, if you don't change the name, then it will overwrite your files because if you want, you could you could take um, the uh, impact and make it, uh, or maybe maybe to the flesh, delay that by 0 0.05 seconds and and uh, maybe delay the impact by 0 0.05 seconds as well. Uh, export those again. And now the uh, demo test clips down here are gonna sound slightly different versus this. And you can see the waveform because it's basically, uh, let me actually delete all these so I can quickly go back and forth. All right, this is the original. That's the delay. So if you want to delay some of the sounds, you can do that. And you can create a lot of different sounds uh, and just you know play around and see what works for you. So this script will be included in all of these character packages and of course the uh, uh, medieval battle sounds pack as well. Uh, a lot of the audio in the character packages come uh, in this in this fashion where they're separated into different layers. And so for mobile developers, um, and people who are just interested in creating new clips of their own, uh, this will come in handy. So if you're interested in any of the characters, I suggest getting that. Um, otherwise, you can get the standalone thing and combine your own clips uh, right away. All right, have a great day, everybody.